Hey guys, what's up? It's Jordan back again with another video. And so for today's video, I'm coming at you with a really big summer haul. This is going to be a really big um, try on summer clothing haul. And yeah, if you're interested in that, just get right on into it. Woo! The first store I went to, I... the first store I purchased online because it's quarantine, we can't go places. I don't even know if that sentence made sense. But the four, oh my God, I cannot talk. Okay, so the first store I purchased things from was Romley. And Romley's like an online thing. They're pretty cheap. You've probably seen like ads for it. But I only got a few things here. And the first thing I got was this like light pink tube top with like butterfly glitter on it. And I really like this. However, However, it's kind of see-through, so I need to figure out how I can wear this so that, you know, the nips aren't showing. Girls out there understand the, understand the struggle. Anyways, the next shirt I got is super cute. It's just this um, white, like, outlined crop top. It, I ordered those in a size small, and it fits really good. I think it's super flattering, perfect for summer. You know, the vibes. Why did I say that? I don't like the word vibes anymore. I don't know why I said vibes. Anyways. Um, and then the last clothing item I got off of Romwe is this really cute pink skirt. And it's a little big around the waist, but I think I can pull it off. It's just like, it's kind of like the Brandy Melville ones, except this one was way cheaper. And it comes with multiple sizes. So we love that. Um... Yeah, so those are all the clothing items I got, and then I got some jewelry. I don't know where all of it is at the moment, um, but I'll show you what I have here. I got these flame little dangly earrings, and then I got two, like, one pair of, like, little butterfly hoops and one pair of bigger butterfly hoops. If I find them, I'll insert the clips, but if I don't, I'm sorry, you're just gonna have to keep guessing on that one. But these are really cute. And yeah, that's everything I got from Romwe. Next place I ordered clothes from was Shein. I'm sure you guys have seen hauls from them. Not from the brand, but like, it's very popular right now. A lot of people are making videos about it. And I've been shopping here for a minute, and I got a lot of stuff for like $115 total. And I just thought I'd share. So, the first shirt is this really pretty, like, red blousey top. Um, I have it in purple if you saw my last haul video, but the red one is super cute, super flattering. You know the drill. The next shirt I got, sorry if I'm like bending down, um, it's because I'll look closer. You, you know the drill. The next shirt I got is um, this like button, it's just this like button up little cardigan top. And you, it's like when I button it, it's a little big around the arms and like the waist area. I wish I got it in a size smaller. But overall, it's very cute. Definitely good for summer. And then the next top I got, I think is so cute. It's very dainty. It's just this like ruffled wrap top. Looks really good with like high rise pants. And yeah, it was, it's just really cute. Perfect for summer. Maybe over a swimsuit whatever you're really feeling um the next top i get got is just this very like trendy style top i need to figure out how to wear it but it like ties in the front it's just a little white sweater very cute very pretty so <clears throat> yeah then the next shirt i got i keep saying like the same phrase sorry if that's annoying not my intent um, the next shirt, though, is this, look how, like, it looks ugly like this, but then, oh, wait, backwards, um, you can tighten it in the front so that it's, like, a little crop top. It looks really good on. You'll see in the try-on clip, but I really love that top. Then, the next shirt I got is just this really dainty blue crop top with, like, lace on the front. These are, like, a very like brandy melville style shirt but i thought it was a good basic to have so i picked that up then 
Then I got some scarves. And my goal with these is to like, you'll see it in the try on, but essentially fold it and wear it as like a little tube top thing. Um, but I got this one that just has this sort of pattern on it. And then I got this one with a chain pattern on it. And these are really cheap, but they're nonetheless very cute. And then the next thing I got is kind of disappointing because it really just doesn't fit me whatsoever. I got it in a medium and it's this like two piece set. You'll see how like it looks, but it would have been way better in a small. It comes with a skirt. I'm going to ask my mom if she can sew it, but it had a lot of potential. It just sadly does not fit very well, but you know, I'm going to stay optimis op optimistic. I'm going to stay optimistic with this one because I think my mom can fix it. Um, and then the next few things I got are bikinis. I got a lot of swimsuits um, because on Shein they're like very inexpensive. I don't know where the... Oh, found it. Yas. Why did I say yas? Okay, so I got a lot of swimsuits. So let's just hop right on into that. So the first one I got is just this like hot pink one that has like detailing. It's super flattering on. And then the bottoms are just, again, hot pink. The next thing, the next swimsuit I got is just this like light pink cheetah print one. Really, really into this one. The top is not a triangle one. It's just like the straight across type thing. And then I got a gold bikini. And this one is really ill-fitting, but I was thinking the top kind of fits me, so maybe with black bottoms. The bottoms were just really bad, like I don't recommend buying this swimsuit, but it had it has potential for the top. The bottoms is going to be a no for me. And then the last swimsuit I got, I don't know where the bottoms are. Oh my god, I just found it. Woo! Okay. So, the last swimsuit I got is just this tie pink tie-dye one that's, like, underwire, you can see. And I just really like the kind of pattern of it. I think it's super cute. Great for summer, again. You know, it's a bikini. Um, and yeah, that's all the swimsuits I got. And then the last thing I got on Shein, I think that's the last thing. Yeah, the last thing I got on Shein is this really pretty dress. And it's a bit big on me, but again, I think my mom can sew it. Um, I'm just really tall, so I didn't want to size down for the dresses. Because it would, like, show my, you know, ass. Um, so I just got the medium. Hopefully she could sew it. Again, very cute if it fit me a little bit better. So yeah, that's everything I got from Shein. And wrong- Oh, no! That's not everything I got. Oh my god. Okay. <laughs> The last thing I got from Shein was this two-piece pajama set. Um, I'm wearing the top right now. It has, like, lace on the bottom, and then it came with these, like, shorts. I really like it. It's super cute, super comfortable. You know, the vibes. Again, with that word, Jordan. Stupid. Um, but, yeah, that's the last thing I got from Shein. And the last pile of clothes I have... Um, are just kind of like a random assortment of things that I've gotten off like Depop, you know, sort of things like that. So, the first shirt I actually made myself, um, but it's like one of those brandy basic tank tops, and I added a little spice with a little flower on it. I might sell this, so if you're interested, check out my Depop. Um, I don't know, it's cute. Um, I don't know if it's like fully my style though, but it definitely is cute and good for summer. The next top I got was in my lookbook, and I got this off of Depop, but it's just like a cropped cardigan, really like the color. And then the next thing I got was also from Depop. It's inside out, that's kind of embarrassing. Okay, I'm like dropping everything. But it's just this, like, long-sleeve Obey shirt. Um, and this, like, recreation... This is, uh, like, a recreation of the Michelangelo painting. I'll, like, insert it here. 
but I really like it and I think it will be like cute with like baggy jeans or like a skater skirt type thing I don't know I think Obey is a really cool brand so I bought that on Depop Whew, I'm out of breath okay and then the next shirt I got was from Dolls Kill. And before I talk about Dolls Kill and like the shirt, I want to first say that I am no longer supporting Dolls Kill whatsoever because they made it clear with the whole George Floyd incident and the whole Black, Li Black Lives Matter movement that they are siding with the police, which is just completely disgusting. And I no longer am going to give them any of my money. I bought this before. Um, all of the things in the media happen and all and I just bought this a long time ago and so please do not buy from Dolls Kill anymore and do not give them your money you can find so many dupes and so many better companies for also way cheaper online Dolls Kill is not that good ethically morally I don't know if those are the same things but they've just shown again and again that they're not a good company and that they've done so many things to lose customers and they just don't deserve your money period um especially considering the fact that they showed support for the police instead of for protesters which is just ridiculous it's just ugh, it makes me really upset um i don't know i think you guys know what i'm trying to say but yeah please do not give them any of your money you can buy dupes of this shirt on Shein and whatever just don't give your money to dolls kill end of conversation so anyways with that i did just get this red shirt that has lace on it it is really cute very flattering um but if you're interested in something like this you can find like exact dupes on shein but yeah i do like that shirt very cute very flattering okay the last thing i actually bought was from my sister she had an old pair of jeans that didn't fit her and i tried them on and they fit me so I paid her $10 for them, and I think it was a steal, because they're just these, like, mid-wash Levi's. Um, they're really cute, really flattering, and I love, I love them. So yeah, I'm pretty sure that that concludes this haul. Yeah, so if you guys enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe. Check out my, my Depop, my Instagram, whatever you want. And comment something on your mind, subscribe if you want to, and I will see you in my next video. Whoosh! Wait, that's what I do for my intro. I'll see you in my next one. Peace. <laughs>